struck by this Bigfoot. It looks so thin and lean, and the arms look so long, and it just, it, I don't know, just the body pose this remind me of a grit of a gibbon. Are the arms outreached like that? Yeah, with a the gibbon, they kind of walk like that. That just looks like a gibbon to me for some reason, but I, I know it's not, but I, it just looks like it. That's Bigfoot, man. Yeah, no, I, it, it is, and you can see in the, in the footage, it, it, there's no doubt about it. It doesn't... Don't deny it. I'm not denying it. Going back to that chimp attack in... Kibali or whatever it is in Africa. I don't know. I wouldn't be relating that to Bigfoot. Though. Well, I am relating it to Bigfoot, and because there have been Bigfoot attacks, and I'm saying that I don't think it's safe for people to just go out in the woods and you know think. Well, obviously, that, the people capturing these fo images, photos, videos, whatever you want to call them, maybe they're lucky. They think it's safe. Yeah, obviously, yeah, they do. Maybe they're not aware of these chimp attacks so and or Bigfoot abductions. The other attack that I was talking about earlier, uh, that a chimpanzee attacked some uh, farmers in a village, and one of the farmers had a machete in his hand, and he cut off the chimp's hand. It's funny seeing the photograph of the chimp, because the chimp's hands are about the size of a human's, but they're really long fingers. And then they barbecue the chimp and fed it to their dogs. Yeah. <laughs> and... Um, I mean, you could make a movie out of that, it, just the, the, the weirdness of it. <laughs> right. But, um, but then, yeah, and there's another, they were talking about how the kid's afraid to go to school. Now they have, because he might be attacked by chimpanzees, him. yeah, they have a nearby chimp, chimp sanctuary, and I don't know if this chimp got loose. Did, it give, did the article give the impression that chimp got loose from the sanctuary? I think they just come from the, world, the jungle down to the to, farms there. Right, and and they also have sanctuary nearby where maybe once they can round up some of the chimps, they put them in a sanctuary. But man, I mean, the, you know, the people in that area know what uh, crime is because they have to deal with it on a you know through chimps, you know, and violence and stuff like that. They know what that that's like. Annie, get your gun.